Convertible Mustangs look great, but adding an aftermarket CDC light bar can really finish off the look to set it apart from any others out there. It's shaped to complement the curves and lines of your Mustang for factory style fitment. Removal of the rear seats will start the install. Begin by pressing the tab on the lower seat section to lift it up and out. One bolt on each side of the bottom of the seat backs hold in the seat. Then unclip the convertible section from the back of the seat to remove it. The tops of the side panels will unclip from the interior, then start removing the speaker covers by removing them from the clips and pushpins. The top seat belt bolt will be removed next in order to add the bracket for the light bar. We temporarily bolted the seat belt back to the bracket to make sure the bracket was in proper place before drilling our extra mounting hole for the bracket. Now you can get out your drill and drill the two new holes needed to mount the bracket to the car. You can remove the seat belt again and attach the hardware to the bracket. Once it is in place, add the seat belt back for good. We now routed the wiring up through the driver side bracket. Once we found the correct wire harness specified, we added the ground wire pin and reconnected the harness. Route the red power wire into the trunk in order to tap into the brake light. It will connect to the harness in the trunk the same way as the black wire. Refer to CDC's instructions for the correct wires to tap into for both wires. Once the red wire is added, you can bring back the slack through the trunk and tie the remaining wire slack out of the way. Now replace the speaker cover panel into the clips and reattach the push pins. CDC gives you a template for where to drill the hole for the light bar brackets. Line up the template and mark the hole to drill accordingly. Once the hole is drilled, reattach the top side panels and pull the wire harness through the driver's side hole to connect the light bar. After connected, feed the wire through the bracket and attach the light bar into place in the brackets. The set screw is accessible through the seat belt slit in the side panels. Tighten the set screws to keep the light bar securely in place. The last remaining step is to replace the seats. Clip the seat backs into place in the car while reattaching the convertible top section. Bolt them back down, then set the bottom seats back into place. Wash the seat belt latches to make sure they are fed through the holes in the seats. Then push them down to clip them in. CDC only uses the highest quality components and finishes when it comes to their aftermarket Mustang accessories, and this light bar is no exception. Installing this accessory will not interfere with the function of your convertible top in any way.